uh, opening up some opportunities out there. And uh, I feel like I didn't shoot as much today, yesterday, but I'm going to get back to that. What's it kind of uh, talk about, like, Soriano a little in the team race? Does that affect you guys at all moving in, or is it the same mindset and you just have to take care of what you can take care of? Uh, if he can compete with us, that's awesome. If not, that's awesome because uh, it gives us a chance to show our strength. So uh, Coach Kell tells a story about a shepherd, and uh, long story short, he the, sh the, the sheep were lost, and the king was going to kill them if, if they didn't like get them back. And he's like, this is awesome. Now I get to show my real strength. And, and then went back and got the sheep. So uh, if we don't have Suriano, we get to show our – everybody else gets to step up and show our strength. So. Do you feel like as a kind of leader of the team and one of the big guns, you it kind of falls on your shoulders to pick up a little more and, like you said, kind of go after bonus points and go after big balls, or is that just something you're already doing? Yeah, I don't really uh, keep that pressure uh, from the team or anything. I I put pressure on myself a little bit. Not really pressure, just uh, excitement and gratitude. And, uh, yeah, I just look, looking to go out there and uh, just score as many points as possible and obviously go for the pin. So. Did you learn from your first meeting with Cameron when you prepared for this fight? Uh, no, uh, I mean I probably learned something, but I just uh, wanted to improve on the score and uh, just continue to score more points. So, but he's a tough opponent, and I just, uh, he's a little bit harder harder to open up than some of the other guys. So I gotta keep working on that. Does that stem from 15, 16 years of rolling around together? We actually didn't wrestle too much in high school. Uh, he would always have his partners, and I would always kind of have my partners. But we'd roll around every once in a while. But I mean, we both improved, so uh, you can't just like look back at what happened and when we were younger and stuff. So, so we're looking at looking forward and looking to the present. So, how is this different than a year ago? Going in, I mean, I'm obviously you're the Big Ten runner up a year ago. You're the, you're the champion now. You're number one, but. Can you kind of compare and contrast the differences of where you're at now versus where you were a year ago? Yeah, going I mean, in as the number two seed. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm on, I'm on top of the podium this week, so uh, it's just continuing. I'm getting, I got a lot better, I think, from last year, and just continuing to put points on the board. And that's that's what I'm gonna say about every answer, but that's my mindset. It just keep scoring points. Can you elaborate on where you've gotten better uh, since then? Because we saw a pretty good product a year ago from you. Yeah, uh, staying out of underhooks. I. I mean, with Martinez, he'd always go under hooks, and I'd kind of keep my arms up because I'm, I'm comfortable there. But I gave up an opportunity last year, and I uh, took advantage of it. So anytime somebody gets under hooks, I'm clear now, I'm trying to go for headlocks or a uh, bunch of different moves I got from there. So I'm just working from over hooks and under hooks and getting better there. Have you always wrestled with this pace? Uh, or I did think. It Snap in some at some point along the way. I don't think it snapped in. I think I gradually, as I got older, I started to become uh, a lot better at it, and I've learned how to manage my energy. And just uh, I just pray that God turns my nerves into energy because uh, I get nervous before I wrestle. But when, when I pray, it just makes me feel a lot better. So, what does it take to wrestle that pace? Uh, just the mindset, and uh, obviously a lot of hard work. So. How much about this is just having fun for you? And how much do you just enjoy it and enjoy competing? And enjoy yeah, it? I'm really grateful for all these opportunities that we get to come out and compete. And uh, so it's a lot of fun, but it's also I'm here to honor God, glorify God, and uh, to do the best that I can with what I'm given. Awesome. Thanks. Yep.